here at Elliot in the Morning's Holidays Concert and joining me is Aaron from Hale Asia. So how's the tour been so far? It's going lovely so far. The cool thing about these kinds of shows is we get to run into old friends, catch up on you know what we've been up to. And what's been your favorite Christmas show that you've performed at in the past couple of years? Has there been one that really stands uh, out? Yeah, there was one we did in Seattle uh, early on uh, on the first record where it was in a basketball arena where the Sonics used to play for those who know about the Supersonics. And I remember walking on stage and feeling like, man, this is so much bigger than I ever planned on happening. It was just an arena full of people. I got him to do the wave all the way across. And so I guess maybe that would be my favorite Christmas show moment that I've had. If I had to pick a favorite song off run, um, it constantly changes. It's between uh, a song called Like People, Like Plastic, or the title track, Run. Those are my two favorite I also love, uh, I mean, I love them all. They're like, you know, I'm sure we answer this the same way, but it's like, you know, choosing your favorite child if you had uh, 13 kids or however many songs on the record. A song called Headrest for My Soul, a really simple number with just a, an acoustic guitar and a vocal, and that would be one of my favorites as well. And how are you planning to stay healthy on the road with this talk? Uh, yeah. No, I just, you know, I, I eat well for the most part. Anytime I feel s sort of strange, I have a great method of, um, you know, taking the right vitamins and, and things. What I don't do is take over-the-counter drugs. That's what I don't do. Okay. And you're vegan, right? I, well, I should tell you that I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm mostly raw. It's hard to do that on tour, so yeah. next up would be a vegan diet. And then, but I, I gotta admit that I do eat sushi, so. Okay. So I, I haven't quit fish, but um, yeah. So most, I would say 80% vegan and raw when I can and some fish on the side. And this morning we took the Struts who are playing this show right. as well. I think they're playing um, right now. They are playing right yeah, now, yeah. yeah. But we took them to the California Pizza Kitchen. Are you a fan of well, pizza? Being from California, it's a funny title. And yeah. I like pizza, of course, but you know now it's gotta be a different situation yeah. for me. But who doesn't like pizza? Jeez, I, I do like the flatter slice, the bigger slice, like more of an East Coast kind of slice. The West Coast doesn't have the best pizza, really. And what's your favorite kind of food? Like, are you a huge sushi fan, I assume? Yeah, sushi is kind of my main, my main go-to thing on the road, at least, because I find that with sushi, you could eat a little bit of it, not get too full, have a little bit of sake with your buddies, and then go play a show and not feel too, you know, bloated or whatever, and, and it's hard to jump around. And it's kind of a weird thing. This is maybe too much information, but it's strange to eat a meal and then go sing, because as you're singing, sometimes you'll, you know, certain weird things will happen and you'll be reminded of the food you ate before and it's not <laughs> cool at all, you know, and you're trying to convey this message and this good feeling to everybody but you're feeling sick inside. I just try not to eat uh, under four hours before we play. And have you got any interesting Christmas gifts from fans? I can't say that I remember one strange Christmas gift necessarily, but I, I do find it to be strange that anyone would want to give me a gift at all, you know, Aww. as a fan. I mean, still when, when people well, what I mean, I guess, is that I still feel very blessed and shocked that people are so affected by these songs that they want to give me a gift. I mean, the gift to me is that I get to play the music, let alone, you know, um, get to see uh, all these people react to these songs. So for them to go the extra mile and actually give me a gift of some sort is pretty mind-blowing. And is there anything you want to say to all your fans out there? Just that I appreciate every every one of them and that you're always welcome in the Wall Nation family. Cool. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. And um, we'll catch you set later.